Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna head south and get mounted troops and start doing caravans. All right, let's see if, um, you know, let's upgrade, actually. We're going to be outnumbered. Let's get one more archer and one more infantryman, which we did not have to pay for. Um, the more advanced the troops are, the more they cost. All right, let's try this out. Okay, I lost two. They lost 11. I could have done better than that. Now the city's right here. We'll stop off and uh, now look. The infantrymen and the archers survived, the promoted ones. It's the recruits that must have died. They're a little weaker. Now the Vigla recruits, go, if you look at them, if you right click, they go to um, Imperial Elite Cataphracts at, let's see, two, three, like fifth level troop. So I'll take, um, I'll take an Imperial Recruit and I'll take one Vigla in the hopes of um, making a mounted troop out of him. That'll put me back up to 10. I'll actually get one more because I want the other 10 when I get up to 20 to be mounted troops. Oh, and let's, um... Back off, stranger, unless you want trouble. command okay this is an open way here let's see infantry. one f1 f no one breathing let the infantry go first and then zero f1 f3 for the archer one of the infantrymen okay let's speak to Rajaya's party as she has the yellow exclamation point she's one of the people we need to speak to regarding Naretz's folly if you please stop there I would ask for your name Um, my name is Adam, madam. May I ask your name? 
I'm Regia, rightful empress of the Calradians. I am Lady of Lycaron and Oneira. I have not heard of you, but you have the look of a man who might make something of himself someday. So I ask Empress Regia, ruler of the Southern Empire, Petros, owner of Cestium, Chinopsis, Castles, Lycaron, and Oneira, what is Noretz's folly? She says, well, that's what some people call the Great Battle of Pendraic in the year 1077. Emperor Noretzes led an army accompanied by Cusates and Asserai to fight a coalition of Sturgians, Batanians, and Vlandians. It was a disaster for him. He died in it, but the victors didn't fare much better. I see. Is there anything else, she asks? Um, I ask her, can you tell me anything about the Battle of Pendraic? She says, of course. I did not witness the battle, but my husband, Arenikos, spoke frequently of it. He was one of the emperor's trusted commanders. He could not stop Noretzes from marching to defeat, but he managed to salvage something from the disaster. When the Sturgians came over our barricades, he managed to lead a group of Noretzi's guardsmen out the back. My husband's small force held together and were joined by stragglers and fugitives. He described the march back, no food, little water, marching day and night to keep ahead of the enemy's outriders but they survived the only organized imperial force to do so. The city was in a state of panic after hearing rumors of what happened. Arenikos kept things from descending into chaos. When it came time for the Senate to choose the next emperor, there was no question that it should be him. I loved him before as a man, but that day learned to love him as something more. What a gift he was to the people of Calradia. I say thank you. Empress Regia says, is there anything else? I say I must leave now. It was good to meet you. Come see me if you need anything. So you see now it says one noble talk to so far. Let's stop off and land. This should help me catch him because it's blocked here. Mess with us and we'll. Okay, attack. On my command! Okay, one F1F3 one F1 for the infantry. And then Warriors, zero F1, F3 no! for the archers to go ahead and catch up. Did not go well.
I might as well promote this guy. I'm overburdened, so my party speed is reduced. My speed should slowly increase as the number of people increase. I do believe I lost a prisoner. Now, in medicine, the first one gives plus five hit points and 30% recovery of lost hit points after each battle. So I'm going to give myself one focus point in medicine to get there. Ah, calculating and merciful, that's decent. Oh, she's got 90 in medicine. She could be a doctor. I'm going to keep myself um, as the doctor until I improve. But I'm going to hire her as I'm going to need um, someone in medicine anyway. Discuss it. And I say I could use someone like her in my company. Um... She needs 491 in advance. So I give her that because I, we can do it. All right. And uh, she joins us. Okay, now I can carry 170. See, the speed of... Um, 54, 48, 47. All right, the maneuver and speed is better on this, but I don't think I have the riding for that. I have riding, 21, okay. We'll buy one horse. Now notice it went up to 190 because of the spare mount. Now swap these. And now it's 270 because this is a, um, the Sumter works better as a pack animal. Okay, we'll pick up in the next episode. Thank you for watching.